Hey everybody. What's up? I heard that. What's up? How are you? I'm gonna shut this window. <clears throat> a little noisy outside. So this morning, I had a lady who rips through my, a lot of people would just rip right through the parking lot and go straight out and avoid the stop sign. So I put mediums out there, concrete mediums, to, to stop that because, you know, my kid gets off the bus, he plays in the parking lot, kids walk through the parking lot. I don't need people ripping through. They still come in fast, but they realize that they can't go out. But this lady came in and she tried going right over top of them and she got stuck and she backed up and went forward and backed up and went forward and dragged them halfway to the street. Uh, lost her mud flaps on her car <laughs> and just proceeded to go down to the uh, travel bureau where I went outside and yelled at her and called her many names. Um, we had to drag those concrete mediums back over. It was really heavy. Probably can't see them from here. I got horrible white balance going on too, sorry. So that was this morning. So I just want to sit down here with the radio for a minute and talk about it. Kevin's already done an awesome evaluation of the box. There's really nothing more to say except for the fact that um, I, I did make them to sell them but I don't have them in stock. I still have to make them in order to sell them. So um, right now we're moving. We're in the middle of moving and a closing date should be coming here any day now. In which case, you know, we've got about a week to get out of the old house and into the new. Produce. Produce. Um, the box, I'm excited about the box. I've ended up using it over almost any of my hacked radios. It's just my go-to box now, pretty much. I mean, I still like my hacked radios. They're cool. I still like the little 587. I've never considered it a... An angel box or whatever they want to holy grail. I've never considered it that. It's nice, but I've heard nicer, really. I think the 589 is a nicer box. It's got a nice deep static that's not annoying. Um, the speaker in that box, though, doesn't fit the power that that radio has. I've noticed that it distorts, especially for music. But that's a great radio, that 589. That's probably one of my favorites. Uh, but this thing, man, it's not a fast scanner, and I could make it a fast scanner, but I think that will take away from what it is. I mean, this is what it is. This is where I'm getting all the, the greatest responses from. If I sped it up, it would just be a PSB. I don't know if those boards are similar or, or what, but this is what I found. This is what I like. I don't necessarily like the Echo too much. It's, it's not a very good echo, and I've tried a few. But it's not bad. It, it's, it's nice if you just give it about a quarter turn, just to put a little bit of effect on there, just to give it a little depth, a little, little bit of, uh, I don't know. It just brings it to life a little more, I guess. Radio and TT. What do you guys think about this box? I am going to play around with, with the settings a little bit. There is another, there's another board that I did find that I'm going to try. And it, it's quite a large board. And it's, it's, it's not a, a free turning uh, potentiometer. It's more of a click. And I, I, I don't know how that's going to work yet. I haven't had the time to sit down and try it out. But if it sounds better than this, I'll implement it. This is a dark video, I'm sorry. So, um, yeah, I'm excited about the box. I really like it a lot. And that's what paranormal investigating and these sessions are about. It's about being excited. It's about enjoying what you do. Getting a relationship with the spirits and sitting down and trying to get some insight. Try to get responses. Try to, try to learn. You know, it's not all about... We'll be walking into a home and, and 
and getting the fuck scared out of you. I mean, who wants to do that? And why would you want to do that? I mean, that's dangerous. <laughs> I mean, that's really dangerous to do that. Um, there's a lot of bad spirits. Just like in life. And death is the same thing. And if I can't see something that's as nasty as, as that, you know, I sure as hell don't want to talk to it. Um, I'll listen. I'll listen. I, I'm, I'm not going to engage in a lot of conversation with something like that, but I will listen and respect it, you know, and, and, and try to learn from it. But I'm... I'm, I'm not into that darkness and, and talking to that, like you see these people on YouTube talking to these demons. It's like, what the fuck's wrong with you, man? <laughs> you, you guys, you guys, you're brave. You're braver than I am. And, and I've had the bad stuff come out, you know, and it ain't fun. I don't want to talk to that shit. So what I do on my channel is I talk to my spirits that are in my shop. If we go to an investigation, we are always always respectful and um, sometimes things happen on an investigation where it might affect us you know I've had a couple times where I was kind of an asshole but I was being affected and you've got to have good people on your team to realize that to understand it and to pull you out of that funk and I think that everybody on our team knows that and we work pretty good together and we look out for each other And this box has been with me on the past three, three trips out, and it works great. When I get out into a, into the field closer to the city, I'll pick up 30, 34 stations, and it just sings. It's it's great. But out here, especially here, I only get anywhere from eight to fifteen. I don't know what I'm getting now. What am I getting now? Thirteen. So yeah, at home I'll get about 20, 22 stations sometimes on a nice clear night. But you only need to grab about eight stations, eight to ten, and, and you're good, man. You'll, you'll pick stuff up. And I'm just talking over this. I don't, I don't know if anything's coming out while I'm talking. Who's here with me? Who's here? We had a problem here yesterday. Sure. And a few days prior, was somebody calling me names. Bumped him. You bumped him? Thank you, man. And that's a total mafia term right there. That means Jasper or Lewis are here. <laughs> Thank you, guys. So, people that are new to my channel, um, I've got. Spirits in here, Jasper and Lewis, um, Lewis Crenshaw, Luke Anot. They were 1930s mafia guys. They have since crossed over, but they do come back and they hang out in this town and they hang out in this shop. They follow me around. They go to the Virgin House where Kathy lives. They hang out there. They're basically spirits that just like to hang out, and there's nothing wrong with that. And they help me here, they warn me, they kick people out, they they do everything, man. They're 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 good spirits. And I like having them around and I can feel when they're around. Sometimes, most of the time, I can sense who it is. Okay, at night when I'm at home, I'll sense somebody and I'll be able to sense whether it's Jasper or Lewis. Sometimes I have to ask. But um, for the most part I know who's who. And they they come and they go. I get a lot of ringing in my ears, so I know, I know that someone's trying to talk to me a lot. Sometimes I hear it, sometimes I don't. So that's it. That's the box. That's a little update. Just a little 
jab, not really a session, just a, just a gab. And sometimes you can tell what song you're, you're, you're listening to. Sometimes it's just a little too slow, it'll hang on, and you can, you can bring it back down towards the bottom, and it's going faster now, see? Oh, I just turned the volume down. I don't even know how to use my own box. There you go. That's quicker. I actually like it a little slower than that. And if you turn it all the way down, what it does is a total silent scan, and it will only stop where those stations are saved. That's total silence. But it's longer in between. I haven't actually tested that out too much. We can test it right now, though. Can you tell me how many fingers I'm holding up? It sounded like a three, but it was. How many? I think that might be a little. That might be a little too hard. If I had 30 stations that were logged in, I could probably work with that, but with only 13, there's a lot of dial in between for that to scan. Thank you guys. 11 minutes already, I've done nothing. <laughs> Just talk, sorry. We're gonna end this. I'll probably edit it out a little bit, if I can. See you guys. Goodbye.